Thanksgiving season, Open Arms in Minnesota will deliver hundreds of meals to people with life-threatening illnesses. You know, they get turkey, mm -hmm. they get the sides, and they get the message that they are loved. Yeah. When we deliver Thanksgiving on Thanksgiving Day, the whole meal comes right to them. Uh, it's such a special time for our volunteers and also the clients as well. We spent some time in the Cambria kitchen with uh, Chef Zachary Duenhager, who shows us one of those side dishes you can make at home, caramelized cauliflower. Chef, it feels like cauliflower season, right? Cauliflower is everywhere. Oh, yeah. But it can be kind of bland unless you know what you're doing. Yep. Normally, people are used to steamed cauliflower or fresh raw cauliflower in some type of veggie platter. So you're going to caramelize it? Yes, we are. All right, let's go. What do we do? All right, I have my pan pretty hot now. I'm going to put a couple couple tablespoons of oil in there. That's, you know, singe off the eyebrows. Yep, yep, That's okay. that. Now you're having fun. Crisp the beard a little bit. Exactly. Let that oil get a little hot. And then cauliflower, you, you just take it and you cut around the core, right? Yep. I typically like to take the head of cauliflower, cut yeah. it in half, and then just start ripping pieces exactly. off with my hands. It, it falls right off. It's really easy. It's pretty quick. And then you just lay it right just down. Just lay it on there. I kind of like to lay it in specific ways that are going to make it look really pretty. If you have a really nice flat edge on the cauliflower, it's yep. going to create a nice bit of color You're on the piece. You need yep. to make it look yep. pretty. Yeah. Look yeah. Nice. I would have dumped yep. all of that in, and it would have made a huge Dump explosion. Dump it in and yeah. grease everywhere. Exactly. And it's no good. It'll watch out for that. And this is on like a medium to high heat. Medium to high. And part of the key is letting it sit for a little while yep. so it does the work, right? You just want to let that heat build up and caramelize the edges of the cauliflower. Cool. And I've gone ahead and I've already made a, uh, a lemon aioli here and some caramelized onions that are going to go with the caramelized Now, cauliflower. lemon aioli, people shouldn't be intimidated. No, no. Because it's mayonnaise. It's just mayonnaise with some lemon and right. a little bit of garlic. But you call it aioli and it makes us all feel yep, fancier. Right? right? That's fine. That's yeah. part of the fun of eating, right? Yep. Tell your family you're eating aioli. And <laughs> they'll be wow. They'll be impressed. Oh, yeah. your Thanksgiving will be yep. amazing. Yes. All right, so you have that. And then uh, when this is done, how long does it take? It'll probably take... 10 minutes or so to get sure. a good amount of color on yeah. all sides of it. And you just flip it when it, because you don't yep. want it to burn, right? I don't want it to burn, and I'm certainly not going to take the pan and try to toss it in the pan, because there's a little bit of oil in there, and you yeah. don't want to burn yourself. No. So I'll just use the tongs and flip it a couple times, and then a couple minutes, we'll be good to go. Now that we have a nice caramelization on this, we're going to dress it up with some pretty easy things to add in, yep. right? I've uh, caramelized some onions. Like I said, I made the um, lemon naoli, and I like to put it on the bottom of the plate. It kind of helps the cauliflower from Sliding around, around, especially sure. if you have a bunch of family over, it <laughs> makes it a little easy on yourself for serving. And then a little chopped parsley, caramelized onions, and throw it all together, and you have a nice, light, refreshing side dish. Looks beautiful. Yeah. Looks beautiful. Thank, Thank you. you very much. Happy Thanksgiving. You, Kylie just said that you couldn't, you couldn't do that. No, no, Why I couldn't make it look that good. What's hard about I it? I think that it, I mean, I don't know, burn the cauliflower. I would have such issues. I mean, he makes it look really easy. I just know that I would take that home. And it would look I, good. I've caramelized a lot of vegetables, uh, never cauliflower, and I've never thought to put it with aioli on the bottom mm. like that. That's a different. Aioli, so fancy. You can make uh, aioli, Kylie. Uh, we'll mayonnaise. See. Just get a scoop I of mayo and add in some water. I call it a culinary <laughs> sham. Yeah. Because it's really mayonnaise with flavor in it. Well, we we were straight up in the story. Though. I'm we very told passionate. You, the truth. you are. You are. There's no sham that. on cooking with CCO. You're calling it out. That's right. The whole right. recipe is at WCCO.com. I promise you, it's easy enough that even Kylie could. I will. I'll take a picture of it. It's not going right. to look that nice right. when I try it. <laughs>